Hey guys, it's Dr. Carla. On this week's Wisdom Wednesday, I'm gonna talk about something that a lot of you don't love working on, and I've been in that camp too. Um, but the big question for you is, is your mobility keeping you from reaching your goals? Now, when I say mobility, let's learn the difference. So flexibility is the amount at which an external force, so if I was coming to stretch you, if I was going to lift your leg up for your hamstrings, that is flexibility, the amount at which your body moves with an external force. Mobility is the amount at which you are able to move your body with your own control. So if I'm working on hamstring, it's how high I can lift my leg under my own like forces. So let's a very simple one in CrossFit is a front rack position. Now, if I don't have enough mobility, the ability to move my body through space to hold a good front rack position, I'm gonna be limited on my front squat, on my strict press, push press, push jerk, shoulder to overhead. And so if I don't work on my mobility and I don't have that, I'm gonna be fighting that the entire time. So instead of working on those lifts, I'm going to be basically limited because my mobility does not allow me to get into that position. And so when you're looking and assessing some of your goals, think about should mobility be higher up on your list? And for many of us, it should be. You're not limited by your strength. You might not be limited by your power, but if you don't have the mobility to have an actual front rack and get that bar sitting on your anterior deltoids, it's gonna be nearly impossible to improve some of the things that you really want to improve. Another one that we see a ton of is an overhead squat. <clears throat> now, so many people say, oh, it's my shoulder mobility. But actually when uh, myself or a coach breaks it down, it doesn't necessarily usually come down to the shoulders. And sometimes it does, but a lot of times you have to look more midline. So if I don't have good shoulder mobility, okay, that's my shoulders, but if I have good shoulder mobility, but my upper back doesn't extend, well, that's a huge problem. Sometimes that mobility goes down to my hips, my knees, my ankles, and sometimes it's a component of all of those things. So if you are struggling with certain lifts, maybe take a step back and ask, what's my mobility like? Am I able to move my body through space without weights adequately for me to improve this? And if it's not, talk with your head coach. Uh, myself and Dr. Lizette are here to help you work on your mobility day in and day out, which we do all the time. And so if mobility is your weak point, maybe make that your focus point for your next 90 days. You never know what could happen with better mobility.